Well, I'm at Burley Salter Town. Come down here to go fishing. It's 1845 and it's absolutely rammed. Uh, paddle boarders, sunbathers, well, swimmers. But, looks like a fisherman's just turned up. So, I'll give it another quarter of an hour. I tide is about quarter past ten, I think, tonight. So, uh, I'll give it another quarter of an hour and I'll have a wander down. So here we are then, we're back out fishing. Ooh, okay. Bloody Salston Beach. Right, what we got? On the left rod, at distance, we've got uh, a pulley panel, and on there is a whole prawn. Nice and fresh, from macro. And on the, uh, and that's on a 2 hook. hook. Um, and on the right rod, we've got frozen black lead tipped off with squid, and that's on, that's on a flapper size two hooks I believe. Anyway, back in a bit. Second cast, well I've changed one of the rigs. On the right hand rig now, aside now, I've got the uh, earth rig. I'm giving that another go. But uh, I've got the proper earth bar for that now, so uh, I've sorted that out. And I've just tipped it off with uh, three hooks and I think they're a size four or two, can't remember. And they're, they're sea glow. Um, and I tipped them off with squid, that's all. See what happens, just scratching a ring with that. Well, it's about eight o'clock now. Seems to be the surface picking up a little bit. Sun's starting to go down, hopefully we might see a bit of action. Bring on the hungry fish, eh? Well, I'm gonna give it another half an hour. Nothing's happened yet. I've just been surrounded by seagulls, trying to pinch my bait. I've had to lock it away. So, uh, unless anything else happens, this is a short video. And I'll see you soon somewhere on another beach, maybe. Evening, folks. Well, I'm on my way to Budley Saltstone Beach for another little session of fishing. This is round two, if you like. Oh, a bit shaky in here. I've got um, sand eel, squid, and frozen black lug. I don't know how long I'm going to fish it for. Um, it's kind of like half past seven at night now, in the evening now, so it could be a short session, um, depending on how I feel. I just wasn't feeling it last time. Um, well, I say last time, but last time I went there, I didn't video it. I caught a small European green eel. Um, I was only there two hours, just wasn't in the mood for it. But um, we'll see. See what uh, see what happens. Fingers crossed. So I'll be fishing. One rod will be on a flapper, probably size two hooks, sea glue two hooks, and on the other rod I will probably do a pulley panel. Might do size two hooks on that or maybe I might go for size one one oh maybe don't know 
we'll see. See what I pull out of the rig wallet. <laughs> anyway, I'll catch you on the beach. And so here we are back on Bully Salt's and Beach fishing. Both rods are up. Back on the multiplier, giving it a go. Looks like they've got a bite. Well, I did until I put the camera on. Well, look at that. My first place. Don't know how big that is, but it's going back. Well, that's the first place I've had. That was the first cast. That's on the uh, frozen black lurgan squid, size one hook, um, on a um, flapper. So no, so it's a size two hook on the flapper rig. Clip down. Chuffed by that. Only been out there five minutes. Well, in all fairness, that was my first ever place. The rod had only been out of there, before. the bait had been out there about five minutes when the bite started, but I thought I let it develop. I'm just glad I did. Low tide was at half past five. It's now eight o'clock. Plenty of fishermen on the beach. Mackerel fishing. Plenty of people having barbecues. Plenty of dog walkers. Um, I'm probably going to stay here till after dark. I've got my head torture with me. So I'm depending on how the fishing's going, that is. I might make this, uh, take this up to 11 o'clock tonight. We will see. After catching that fish, confidence is restored. So I'm, I'm buzzing a bit. It's starting to get a bit chilly now. Anyway, lots of that. Back to fishing. I have a bite again on the right hand rod on the flapper. Well, to be fair, I'm getting on all right with that multiplier. Don't like to speak too soon, but no bird's nest yet. That's my third, fourth, third cast. Fourth cast, maybe. I've taken the, uh, the magnets off three clicks. So, getting a bit confident. I'm just going to be careful I don't get a nest. Not even a sniff on that sand eel yet. Well, it looks like the tide's starting to come in now. Guess we forgot to bring our rag. Yeah, exactly.
Right, so I've just changed the bait on the left hand rod. It had been stripped. It's now a whole squid. I think I'll give it another oh, half hour and then I'll bring them in, call it a night. Don't know what that was, but there's a big rattle. I've got a feeling it's crabs. Well, that's the end of the second session here on Budley Salterton Beach. First time wasn't nothing except for seagulls trying to pinch my bait. But uh, this two, two and a half hour session on uh, the beach this time, um, I caught my first place, just the bits. I would probably at a rough guess say it was about 10 to 12 inches long. I haven't got a tape measure with me. But that's just at a rough guess going by the Tronix Pro bait bag. Which is about 12 inches wide. Or whatever, long. So, probably hard to tell in there on the video. So I had nothing to um, compare it to. But that's just, um, uh, I don't know, an example. But anyway, chuffed a bits with that. I will come back next time I'm down here. I've got a caravan for the night, so I'm going to pop back there now. Have a cup of drinky poos. Chinese takeaway. And then up early in the morning, see if I can beat the traffic back. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye for now.